There are over 30 medical schools in the UK, each with their own unique characteristics, teaching styles, entry requirements, and so on. Considering that there are only four spaces allowed on the UCAS application, choosing the right medical or dental school is not an easy task. And here is where medical school rankings come into play. Medical school rankings evaluate medical schools around the world to help you navigate this tricky decision, as they provide a measure of the university's performance and reputation. However, there are so many different rankings that it can be really difficult to know which ones to trust and which ones to ignore. So in this video, we're going to take a look at some of the most well-known university rankings, as well as their methodologies, so that you can use them to make a more informed decision. Let's get into it. The first one we're going to look at is the QS World University Rankings. The annual guide by the QS company is one of the most widely read university rankings in the world. The reason behind the popularity of the QS rankings is that it provides a global perspective on medical school and universities. It also ranks schools across all disciplines based on a variety of factors, including academic reputation, research impact, and employer reputation. On the downside, however, it might not provide a detailed view of each university's strengths and weaknesses. The rankings mainly rely on subjective measures such as academic reputation, which may be influenced by factors such as media coverage and personal bias. QS has also faced some criticism for focusing too much on peer reviews. According to the QS rankings, these are the top 10 medical schools around the world in 2024. Number one is Harvard University. Number two is University of Oxford. Number three is Stanford University. Up fourth is John Hopkins University. Fifth is the University of Cambridge. At sixth place is UCL. Number seven is Karolinska Institutet. Eight is Imperial College London. Number nine is University of California in San Francisco. And number 10 is Yale University. Up next is the Times Higher Education World University Rankings. This is the annual publication of university rankings by the Times Higher Education magazine. It evaluates different universities around the world based on different factors, including teaching, diversity, and research. The upsides of this ranking is that they evaluate universities from all over the world with a global perspective, taking various factors into account. Also, it doesn't focus on a single discipline, providing a more comprehensive university ranking. However, just like the QS university ranking, it may rely on some subjective measures, including academic reputation. It may not also explain the strengths and weaknesses of different universities in detail. Here are the top 10 medical schools according to the Times Higher Education World University. Number one is the University of Oxford. Number two is Stanford University. Number three is Massachusetts Institute of Technology. Number four is Harvard University. Number five is the University of Cambridge. Number six is Princeton University. Number seven is California Institute of Technology. Number eight is Imperial College London. Number nine is the University of California, Berkeley. And at number 10 is Yale University. The third university ranking system we're going to look at is the Academic Ranking of World Universities, also known as the Shanghai Ranking. This annual publication by the Shanghai Ranking Consultancy is considered one of the most influential university rankings. It focuses on universities and colleges all over the world in various fields, including medical science, based on criteria including quality of education, quality of the faculty and research output. The Shanghai Ranking System focuses on research quality and output, which may be an important factor if you are considering medical programs which are more research orientated. However, like the other ranking systems we have already considered, the Shanghai Ranking does not consider each university's strengths or weaknesses. It may not also take into account other factors including student selectivity 
and it has been criticised for being more biased towards larger and more research focused universities. These are the top 10 universities of 2024 according to the Shanghai ranking. Number one is Harvard University, number two is Stanford University, number three is Massachusetts Institute of Technology, four is the University of Cambridge, number five is the University of California in Berkeley, number six is Princeton University, number seven is the University of Oxford, number eight is Columbia University, number nine is California Institute of Technology, and number 10 is the University of Chicago. The next ranking system we are looking at is the Complete University Guide, which is very popular in the UK and has been active since 2007. This ranking evaluates universities based on different criteria, including entry standards, research quality, student to staff ratios, and more. The Complete University Guide takes into account a number of different sources, like the National Student Survey and the Higher Education Statistics Agency, to calculate overall rankings for each university. It is also an independent ranking provider, so it may be able to provide unbiased rankings for each university. A possible downside is that it focuses solely on universities in the UK, which may limit its usefulness for students who are considering studying abroad. It also places much less emphasis on student satisfaction compared to other rankings, and it puts a lot of weight on research quality, which may or may not be useful for every medical student. According to the Complete University Guide, here are the top 10 medical schools of 2024. Number one is the University of Cambridge. Number two is the University of Oxford. Number three is UCL. Number four is Imperial College London. Number five is the University of Edinburgh. Number six is the University of Bristol. Number seven is the University of Glasgow. Number eight is Queen's University in Belfast. Number nine is the University of Dundee. And number 10 is the University of St. Andrews. We then have a university ranking system which you might know well, which is the Guardian University Guide. This UK-based guide evaluates universities and colleges all over the UK, including medical schools. The positives are that the guide provides a detailed view of universities across all disciplines in the UK. It ranks schools based on several factors, including student satisfaction and graduate employability which may be important for students who are interested in the practical application of their medical degree. However, on the downside, just like our previous ranking, it focuses only on medical schools and universities in the UK. It also may not provide a full view of each university's research output or academic reputation. If you are curious, here are the best medical schools in the UK according to the Guardian University Guide. Number one is Aberdeen. Number two is Cambridge. Number three is St. Andrews. Number four is Swansea. Number five is Edinburgh. At number six, we have Keele. Number seven is Imperial College. Number eight is Oxford. Number nine is Glasgow. And number 10 is Brighton and Sussex Medical School. The final one we'll be reviewing today is the Weather Metrics Ranking of World Universities. This is a free ranking system by the Cybermetrics Lab based on criteria such as web presence, visibility, and impact. It covers more than 30,000 universities worldwide, and it offers a useful tool for universities to assess their online presence and identify areas for improvement. However, it has been criticized for being biased towards universities that are larger and have a greater web presence rather than academic quality. Web Metrics has been accused of vanity ranking that encourages universities to prioritize their online presence over other important academic aspects, including teaching and research. According to Web Metrics, here are the top 10 universities in the UK for 2024. Number one is the University of Oxford. Number two is the University of Cambridge. Number three is UCL. Number four is Imperial College London. Number five is the University of Edinburgh. Number six is the University of Manchester. 
Number seven is King's College London. Number eight is the University of Leeds. Number nine is the University of Nottingham. And number 10 is the University of Warwick. So based on everything that we have discussed so far, which ranking system should you pay attention to? Well, it really depends on the kind of medical school that you are looking for. Some are slightly more research-based, whereas others are slightly more holistic. What you should try to do is look at the whole picture. The academic ranking, for example, looks at research quality and output, whereas The Guardian will look at student satisfaction and graduate employability. The important thing to keep in mind is that while these ranking systems can be really useful in helping you to choose the universities that might be best for you, they aren't the only tool that you should be using to make this decision. After all, you will be choosing the place where you'll be spending the next five to six years, so it's not a decision you want to take lightly. I would recommend that you check out this video here where I talk about how to choose the right medical school for you and what considerations to make when you are making that decision. And if you are interested in more personalised support, check out FutureDoc's website where we will help you to make a strategic and tactical choice where you will have the highest chance of getting into medical or dental school. If you liked this video, don't forget to subscribe, leave this video a thumbs up and leave any questions or comments below. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.